Hi, this is Shoda from Punoscho once again and uh, we know that you are liking our video. So that's a very good news for us. Please do subscribe for more videos. Right now we are with the 6 to 35 volt USB QCPD converter adapter and how we can use it. We will test it right now. So this module comes with a very specific uh, protocol supports. I don't know if you can read it properly. Let me help you. It's written over here quick uh, charge 4 plus QC4 SCP and supports the VOOC PD 2.0 3.0 AFC and WTK protocol. So other than that, it's having a USB A, USB C, uh, two input section for the powering things and two LEDs. One is the blue and one is the red LED. The blue, blue LED indicate that it's powered on and the red LED when it detects that the charging of quick charge is activated. So it's, it's actually shows that things out there. So let's connect it. So I have already made a connections over here and these connections is uh, with a four battery. So I am using a four 4.2 volt battery in series to having 16.8 volt. You can do it within 6 to 35 volts. So ma major sources of power for like solar panels or uh, back car batteries all are supported with this module. So right now the LED is glowing in blue that indicates that it's powered on. What I am going to do now, I will charge two batteries, uh, two phones uh, using this one and see whether it detects the quick charge or not. So I have the Poco phone over here. I am not sure about the model, but I do know that it supports the quick charge protocol. This is the Motorola phone. So I will test all these two phones with this one and test how this is going to work. So let's first uh, uh, check with the USB-C to USB-C. So I have a USB-C. Make sure when you are testing this module or working with this module, you have a proper quick charge enable USB-C uh, wire. So let's connect it up. I am connecting it with the Motorola one first and let's see what is the output. So I have connected it already. So it's detected turbo power and if you can see the red LED is glowing over here that is indicating that quick charge protocol is detected and activated. So let's just turn it off and see with the POCO phone that I have over here. Let me connect it up. I have just connected it up and if you can see it's showing quick charge protocol. So that means it's supporting the quick charge. This is gone for the USB C1. Now let's uh, identify what uh, is the protocol and how the activations work in the USB A protocol. So let me disconnect these things once again. Let me have my USB C to USB A connectors. So it is also quick charge enable. Make sure you have that things out there. So I am connecting it here and connecting these things here okay so again it's detected the quick charge which is far more good let's see with the Motorola one as well so I have connected the Motorola one and it's detected the turbo power so this is a very cheap module, it doesn't cost too much. This is a very small module as well. You can easily fit into your DIY box or some other places, for example, in your scooter or bike. Uh, many people actually use the charging peripherals, but they rarely charge in quick charging mode. This can be used very easily and can be used for quick charge. And um, this module, one, one most important thing of this module is the input voltage. It supports from 6 to 35 volt. The supporting 12 volt batteries, maybe bike batteries or 24 volt batteries, which is pretty good, obviously. I would like to have a 48 volt support as well, but it doesn't support 48 volts. So nothing to do over here. So this is all for this video and how you can just uh, connect it up and just get it started. It is already available in your in our website. We will provide all the informations in the YouTube video link descriptions. So please do visit to us. Please subscribe us. There is a bell icon over there 
and a subscription icon over there just to subscribe and get more information about this quick small and very easy to understand interfacing guides for the products so that's all for today thank you thanks a lot bye bye